MILF Carters organized Sunday ceasefire, which was to run from 8 a.m. until noon. They roamed the streets with loud hailers, urging residents to leave. But by 9 a.m., gunfire had broken out, apparently deterring residents from joining a mass exodus. About 2,000 civilians remain in the city. Philippine President Rodrigo Duterte predicted the siege would be over within days, despite fierce resistance by fighters aligned to Daesh in the dense urban heart of the southern Philippine city. About 400 local militants reinforced by about 40 foreign fighters stormed Marawi on May 23rd, using sophisticated battlefield tactics to take control of large swathes of the lakeside city. They have been pushed back to the city centre by Philippine forces over the past week after some 4,000 ground troops were bolstered by helicopters and aircraft deploying rockets and bombs. Authorities lifted the civilian death toll from 20 to 38 on Sunday, but said all those deaths were caused by militants. A presidential spokesman said 120 militants had died, along with 38 government forces.